was no doubt about the quality of the product at the Lyceum, when more than 60 stunning beauties lined up on the night of the Miss World final. Graham Hill and Stanley Baker with Richard Todd were judges. Some job. This was Miss Argentina. Miss Australia. Miss France. Miss Israel. Miss Guyana. And a homegrown favorite, Miss United Kingdom. Somehow, the panel of experts managed to decide on a last 15. Then, poor things, they had to cast their eyes along the line again to whittle the marvelous missus down to a succulent seven. Well, there they were, seven gorgeous girls just second away from that final decision. Oh, the agony of it. And there she was, Miss World 1968. Penny Plummer, the blonde from Down Under. As they say in Australia, what a beaut. This was the moment of beautiful triumph as the retiring queen, Peru's Madeleine Hartog Bell, installed the new monarch of female proportions. Ahead of the 18-year-old super miss waits a magic year. 2,500 pounds was already hers in prize money. But during the next 365 glamour-packed days, there are also 40,000 pounds worth of engagements just waiting for her. Penny used to be a librarian. From now on, the only books she'll have to look after will be legends. <laughs> 